Our educator Yeshi brought some materials to the afternoon class in a container. I'm curious about them since I found them intriguing. I sprang out of the chair and ran toward the box. After that, I understood that items were paper, multiple dry pen brushes, dry plastic jars, and wall color, similar supplies I had used in Kingdom Garden. Pachini Kachipo 2016 reported that, in early child settings, five materials are most readily available, paper, charcoal, pen, clay, and blocks. Besides, I also find some tree materials in the container. When the educator handed us a sheet of paper, I felt it slippery and silky. When I selected pen brushes of various size, I discovered that some had a delicate short hair and others had a wider fluffy hair. Moreover, when there are six kinds of pen in the container, yellow, blue, pink, orange, white, and black, I collected five colors except for white because I think the paper is white and there is no layering. As I collected pen, it is stuck to my hand. When I touched them and I felt them were sticky, easy to express and hard to clean. Pachini Catching Bone 2016 reported that the pen would have consistency and certification properties as well as get dirty for users. After that, the educator divided us into two groups, with two people working in each group. My artistic exploration also included pen pairing and separating several dry and clean pen brushes to prevent too much pigment from mixing. For instance, the brown pen brushes represent a mixed hue, the red pen brushes will represent red, and blue pen brushes will represent blue, and so on. I did not want to use one brush for several colors, because doing so would muddle my colors and cause my painting to look differently than I intended. They can also seem like a backup to the pen brushes. Pillow 2016 reported that the use of separate brushes for each color helps to avoid color mixing. When I noticed the weather, I saw a rainbow in the sky, and the paper encouraged me to create it. I knew there were five different hues and that a rainbow required more shade. I liked a variety of hues and didn't know what to do. I heard the pen brushes and pen set try to mix me. I was currently exploring and experiment with different colors and combination with pen brushes and pens. I discovered that yellow and blue blended together. Then I dipped my pen brushes into it and created lines. I was surprised that it turned green. Based on my curiosity and the previous experiments, I tried several times with different colors, resulting in several colors. Pelo 2016 suggested that young children are likely to be surprised by what color matches different hue and they come into contact with it. Additionally, I used the red and black pen to draw the dots on the paper with brushes. Later, I mixed the color by adding water to the gel. I couldn't wait the pen in known paper because I felt so at ease when I did. A roller that was borrowed from someone and dipped a hole into the pen after being placed in a plastic container. I rolled the roller on the paper as introduced by the roller. Coated it thoroughly and provides me with a counter force. When I used it on paper, I pull it forward and pulls back. And I then grasp a corner in my hand and roll the roller. Besides, I found that after the colors in the gel was mixed, the green was very prominent. Furthermore, I finished the painting a few hours later and I placed it on the table to dry. A different shapes will come from viewing my pictures again from different angles or at different times. I was surprised to turn the paper in many ways. For example, when I looked at it from overhead, I would view several smiling faces. When I see it from an angle, I can see an insect on the paper. When I reverse it, I could see a tornado attack the land. The painting's proportions change over time and between classrooms to create streaky singularities. As the time passes, the room's lighting will also affect how the painting looks like. During the class, Steven was my partner. At the start of our artistic creativity, we helped each other get a paint, water, pen brushes, and other materials. We shared ideas during the art creativity process. And if one of us get the dirty pen brushes while painting, the other will prepare a clean, dry brushes for him. In the end, we both produced the quality paintings represented one other's portfolios and asked a lot of cool questions. Palo 2016 reported that a group of kids can be asked to work on a big piece of paper to strengthen their points and explore cooperation. 